But the Very Good Butchers, we butcher beans. We're a vegan butcher shop, so we create a range of plant-based meat alternatives. All sorts of things that you might find at a traditional butcher shop, you can find here at this cruelty-free butcher shop. Beans, they don't hurt the way animals do. We can make things that look, taste, and are very similar to meat without any harm or cruelty. I love it when someone comes in, they don't really realize I've had a vegan meal, they just walk off oblivious, thinking they've come into a butcher shop or a restaurant and had a, you know, a, an animal product, and uh, no, that's been completely plant-based. It's, it's a great feeling. So we use a lot of herbs and spices that you'd associate with very like meaty dishes. So if we're making a beefy thing, we'll use like thyme and rosemary and lots of garlic and onions, that kind of thing. So like those flavors that you associate with that animal flavor, doesn't necessarily have the animal flavor, but it's all those flavors that kind of make up that experience of when you're having like a stew or a roast dinner or something. It's, it's really all the things that go with it that make up those dishes, not just the fact that it has some beef or pork in it or chicken. The ribs are uh, yeah, one of our most popular items. They kind of have this nice chewy texture and taste to them. Our goal is just to make delicious food, to make veganism approachable, familiar, delicious. That's why we kind of focused on meat alternatives, comfort food. We just wanted to show that being a vegan, you don't have to give up anything, you don't have to sacrifice anything. You can still come out, have a burger, have a poutine, have some mac and cheese, have all your favorite food, but just have the plant-based version of it. I butcher beans. I butcher beans. What does that do? What does that do? What does that do? What does that do?